Hello, my name is Andrew Hyatt from Environmental Compliance Equipment, and we're here to show you the operation of our ClearFlow system, our model CF200. The ClearFlow system is a fully automated wastewater treatment process. It utilizes our ClearFlock proprietary bentonite clay blends to treat industrial wastewater. The system is a fully automated process constructed of 304 stainless steel with a powder coating and then a clear ceramic coating on top. The entire system is designed as a rugged operation designed for long-lasting service. The components that make up the ClearFlow system are first the process tank, we have the filter tray, mixer motor, motorized ball valves, and the main pump. Control panel. This is our dosing hopper. This hopper holds about 350 pounds of our clear flock. The process begins by the pump pulling the wastewater from the client supplied tank. The pump will turn on and pull wastewater from the customer supplied tank through this uh, motorized ball valve and then through the piping, through the pump, and fill up the process tank. Once the process tank is filled, the mixer motor will turn on and mix the contents of the process tank. The dosing unit will be initiated and dose in the proper amount of clear flock into the process tank. The mixer motor will then continue to mix, allowing the, the clear flock to encapsulate the contaminants of the wastewater. After the post-mix process, the system will then go into a settling mode and allow the flock to settle into the process tank, to the bottom of the process tank. After the settling time, the pump will be turned on and pump the complete water and solids from the process tank up to the filter belt for separation. On the filter belt, we have a 50 micron filter paper that is laid across the filter belt. The filter paper will separate out the flock solids from the clear water. The clear water will come through the filter belt into the bottom of the tray and then exit out of the tray and off to a secondary process or off to uh, discharge. While the system is pumping the processed water up to the filter belt, the filter belt is monitored by two probes, which when the filter paper becomes blinded, the probes uh, touch the water and the uh, system will then turn the pump off from feeding the water up to the belt and advance the belt forward automatically, indexing new filter paper onto the belt for further processing. This process will happen continuously until the entire process tank is empty. And then when the process tank is empty, uh, it'll send up the final solids that are in the tank. And then once that is done, we have a uh, freshwater rinse on the system that actually rinses out the entire process tank. The remaining water goes up to the filter belts. And then when that is done, the system then looks at the customer's wastewater tank to see if there's more water to process, and then processes another full batch of the customer's wastewater. This is considered a continuous batch treatment process. This is our control panel that controls the entire process. As I mentioned, this is a fully automated process. And we have a touch screen here that allows the operators to interface with the, with the programmable logic controller to set up timers, to uh, check inputs, check alarms on the system. It also allows the operators to manually operate the system if need be. With the automation of this process, with the variable speed drives and the PLC, you're able to really dial in the customer's needs for their particular waste stream. Some may need a faster mix, some may need a slower mix. So there's a lot of variability in the system design in order for the, cu the customer to customize the system to their particular process. The resulting solids that come off of the process are an inert material that when T-clipped can pass the toxic chemical leachability profile where the solids could then be sent to a non-hazardous landfill. The clear flow process comes in multiple sizes, 200 gallon, 400 gallon, 600 and 800 gallon, giving the customer the opportunity to treat up to 1600 gallons per hour of industrial wastewater. Thank you very much for watching this video and have a great day.